What's up guys welcome back to yet another video. We have a new update rolling out for OnePlus 8 series which is Oxygen OS 11.0.10.10. This update doesn't bring any kind of new add-ons but few fixes over the previous update. Before starting with the video let's keep a like target of 400 likes and we have 80% of users who haven't subscribed to our channel. It's a humble request do consider subscribing and also press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video. So here I have my OnePlus 8 on which I've already installed this latest update. Let me show you the software information by going to about section. Here you can see it's Android 11. Build number says Oxygen OS 11.0.10.10. This update comes with December 2021 security patch. These are the benchmark results towards the left hand side. We have OnePlus 8 on which I have done benchmark testing after installing this latest update. Here the single core scores are 881 and multi core scores are 3123. And towards the right hand side, those scores are from our previous video of OnePlus 8 series. in which single core scored 850 and multi core scored 3111 similar scores on both these updates with the entoto benchmark application scores are 659932 as said earlier this update doesn't bring any kind of new features camera app version also remains same so this is the camera app version on this latest update which is version 5.8.110 and let me show you the camera app version present on previous update so here i have a screenshot of that And here you can take a look camera app is similar on both these updates. So don't expect any kind of improvements in the picture quality or camera performance. And now let's also take a look whether OnePlus have given the support of 90 fps in Battlegrounds Mobile India or not. So here we have the game. Let me show you the graphics settings first. So under graphics you can see we are using smooth and 90 fps which should mostly give us 90 fps output while gaming. But let's turn on system status from the gaming dashboard. And here you can take a look maximum output here is 60 fps. So come on OnePlus it's been a long time we have been compromising on this stuff. And I'll soon be creating a post on OnePlus community to request for this feature on OnePlus devices. None of the OnePlus devices have the support of 90 fps in Battlegrounds Mobile India. So soon I create a post about the same. I'll update you guys on our YouTube community post. OT update is rolling out in batches so it might take some time to receive it on your device. I performed a local upgrade on my device because I did not receive OT update via system update section. I'll try to provide all the files of the latest update in the description below. Just download that file and place it inside the internal storage. As you can see here I have OnePlus 8 incremental update because I was running on Oxygen OS 11.0.9.9. Once you download this file place it inside the internal storage for me the update size was 116 MB after that go to system system update tap on this gear icon towards the right top corner select local upgrade and you should see the file if you haven't updated your device to latest build and these are the changes what they have done on the latest build of oxygen os which are completely related to system and the first one they say they have optimized the ui display of settings interface and trust me guys they have still not optimized what they have mentioned in the description so here we have the settings page and if you scroll down you can see the alignment of digital wellbeing in the settings page on the previous update we had the same issue with google section along with digital wellbeing so here only one thing have been fixed and that's the google section in the settings panel Digital well-being section is still not properly aligned. But there's a work around until we get a new update. So what you have to do is to fix this issue of digital well-being alignment. You need to go to apps and notification, tap on see all apps. Then on the right top corner you'll see these three dots. Tap on show system, and then search for digital well-being. Once you find this APK, again tap on these three dots, and from here you need to uninstall the updates. Uninstall the update. and also make sure guys you don't update this application once you have uninstalled the update for example if you go to play store and check for the update here you can see we have an update available for digital wellbeing but soon you update that the alignment will be again messed up so right now we have uninstalled the update and if you go to settings and here you can see alignment of digital wellbeing is still not fixed so just reboot your device to fix it let's long press on the power key tapping on reboot and wait for a device to boot up So our device have been successfully booted up. Let's go to settings and scroll down to digital well-being. So here you can see by uninstalling the update of digital well-being, the alignment can be easily fixed. I don't know why OnePlus says they have optimized the settings page UI without even fixing the known issues. Later with this update, they have done few fixes layer to the setup page of Google Assistant and Google Pay. I personally never encountered any kind of issues with these two things. If you guys have faced any issues, then do let me know in the comment section below. After that, few fixes layer to WhatsApp crash. 
and we had seen similar change logs on OnePlus 7 series latest update too. Later they have updated the security patch to 1st December 2021. So guys this was a quick look on the latest update for OnePlus 8 series and you guys let me know in the comment section below whether you guys want a detailed review on this particular build or not. And also let me know after updating to the latest build are you guys also facing the same issue of alignment with digital well-being or not. As of now only this much in this video. I hope you guys like the video. If you like the video then do give me a thumbs up. And also if you are new to our channel then do not forget to subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.